Say good kiss me. Good morning! Magandang umaga, Pilipinas! Ahoy, Czech Republic! So, Sofia, this is her last day holiday. Because tomorrow, Sofia will be back to school as her first day at school. Hmm? So, she is back to normal starting tomorrow. And Tata, I'm so excited. you're still excited? Yes. You are excited. You are excited? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. And today, they would like to see Mommy Hannah. Ah, uh, sigurado po pag-uwi niya, gutom siya. So, magluluto po ako ng munggo. Ginisang munggo. What do you call this in English, Pinka? Mung bean. Okay, munggo. In Tagalog, munggo. In Bisaya, munggo. So, pakakuloan ko muna to para lambutin ko. So, ang lulutuin ko ngayon, ito ay ang ginisang munggo. But since Hannah, uh, she avoids eating uh, pork. So, we're gonna eat, I'm gonna put some um, chicken instead of pork. Tingnan natin kung magugustuhan ni Hannah ang ginisang munggo na may manok. Right, Pinkay? Yeah. Look at Sophia's teeth. It's coming out. It's coming out, right? Here, 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 yeah. here, and here, and here. Yeah. I have six teeth falling out. <laughs> Ahoy, Czech Republic! Ahoy, Czech Republic! Ahoy, Czech Republic! Ahoy, Czech Republic! Mabuhay, Czech Republic! Mabuhay, Mabuhay Philippines! Ahoy, Philippines! So, today, dahil may nag-request sa akin, isa sa mga one of our viewers mm. suggested me to cook this one for you. Ooh! <laughs> so, it's good because I said, like, you never tried mung bean. Mm. This is mung bean in English. and Tagalog, it's munggo. Mm. So, ginisang munggo. First time na... Matik manihanat ni Sofia. So try darling if you like mung mungo mungo. You try mungo mungo mungo. Smells good, really. Mmm. <laughs> smells just like try. Um, because I want to give me score. It smells like um, okay, bean soup. Bean soup. Mm -hmm. Or oh, like a bean soup. Mmm. Okay. Mmm. -hmm. Yummy. So, what's this? This white chicken oh, breast. Chicken. Mm. chicken breast. So, what's this good? Mm. And muscle? Mm -hmm. Because I'm scared that um, I would put uh, like it's gonna be salty. Mm. Really yummy. Mm. Really yummy. Mm -hmm. So I'll give you from ten. Yeah, one I'll to ten. Give you nine and a half. Wow, <laughs> <laughs> it's getting higher and higher. You can buy. Um, nine. Nine? Wow! Oh. Better than seven. Yeah. Better than seven. Last time I got seven. Yes. So you want salt? Because it's up to you. You for me this is okay. No, it's okay. It's okay. Okay. Mmm. <sighs> where have you been all the time? Where? Where? Why you didn't cook before? <laughs> before? That's my secret. How you make your wife. Fall in love with you. Oh. Before you but always and cook stinky food. Yeah, and <laughs> mm. He said stinky food was delicious. Mm. Some of the stinky sh uh, shoes. <laughs> <laughs> stinky food is delicious. Mm. Mm. The idea came from one of the viewers, mm. one of the subscribers, and said, Why don't you cook uh, kinisang lungo mm -hmm. for your family? So I said, Okay, one day I will try. 
hard. I really like yummy. It. It's really yummy. And you come home hungry and the food is on the table. Mm -hmm. Thank you, darling. Yeah? Of course, yeah. But, mm -hmm. because I promised them to answer their questions, today we have a, a question and answer portion. Do you understand me? Okay. <laughs> So, first question mm -hmm. is from Antonio Arnel Palma Hill. Have you tried to learn Czech language or Miss Hanam? Have you tried to learn uh, Filipino language? No. Didn't. It's really hard. Can't get it. But what is good, uh, even in your family, Filipino use the English. Mm -hmm. So at least I have idea what he's talking know, about. I don't understand Filipino. I, I don't know how to talk Filipino, but I know how to read Filipino. Yeah. Yeah. For me, check. I know. Rosimim, chess. I that means I understand chess. Rosimim, chess key, malo. A little bit. <laughs> No, the Czech language is really very difficult. Very yeah. difficult, the Czech language. The Czech language, um, Filipino, Filipino, it's it's easy to read Filipino, but Czech, I know how to read Czech, but not mm. that much. I sometimes struggle. It's not that easy to read Czech. But do you speak Czech? Yeah. Tell them. Tell Yeah, she, her, uh, Sophia speaks Czech. Yeah, but her Czech is really weird. Mm. But she understands everything that I say. About yeah, transferring in English. Her check is like Chinese speaking Tagalog. Mm -hmm. That's uh, Sophia's check language. You know, just imagine <laughs> the Chinese speaking Tagalog. That's how Sophia. It's understandable, but it's a wrong grammar. Mm -hmm. huh? So next one mm -hmm. from Aphrodite Blog. I don't know if it's silent, ma'am. I don't know if it's silent V. Or it's of law or law but anyway here she said my boyfriend is from Czech Ooh. okay always told me that normally mm -hmm. Czechs don't initiatively approach people for small talk is that true you don't like approach people for small talk like you do that first no I, you... I always approach the people I like to talk with people Oh, so I think that's different. That's yes. a, uh, individual. De depends of the person. Oh, maybe. But Anna does. She always uh, approaches people. Yeah. To that's what I observed. You always complain that I'm too friendly. Mm. Um, yeah, to be honest with you. Yeah. yeah, but mommy sometimes trick when I don't get it right. But that is more stricter because <laughs> I told you last time that that that. Like when you're doing math or something, something, and when it's so easy and you get it wrong, you'll see what will happen. <laughs> <laughs> what will happen? You'll take your most precious thing that you ever had. The most, the most precious thing, no, like a no, mommy? No, or no, no the, the, the gadget, the most mm. precious gadget you have. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Okay. My iPhone. Your but iPad is more precious than mommy and daddy? No, I said my precious gadget, my most precious gadget. 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 This one, it tastes like a pumpkin. Yeah, to me. it's like squash. Pumpkin or squash in Philippines. Alright. Does chick people, do chick people are cold at first, but when you try, when you try hang out with them, gradually it breaks the barrier. Is it true on your experience? No, to be honest. No, no, no. Um, I didn't get it. Say again. Like, they don't Czech people don't approach, right? Mm. But when you try to approach them and mm. you try to talk to them, oh, the barrier is gone. And then maybe yeah. they are more talkative than you, uh, than you think. Than you think. Yeah. yeah, maybe. Yeah. Maybe it's right because I notice like uh, Czech people never ask for help. Because, <laughs> or um, maybe... More pink eye soup. The, the Czech people never ask for help because usually... They don't get the help. <laughs> All right. It's like, okay. a, do you need help? Help yourself. Okay. After that, I hope we're hoping that we answer we answer your question. So, uh, shout out to Ivy. Her name is Ivy. 
and her boyfriend is Martin. I think they're from, um, if I'm not mistaken, they're in Olmoch. Olmoch. That is close to Hannah, like for two hours travel. Yeah. From Hannah's place. Two no. minutes. So, next question, big guy. From funny moments, hmm? do you want to learn Tagalog? No. Yeah. Imagine but, um, for me. But I have. Um, but the real do you want to learn Tagalog? Uh -uh. No? no. Why? It's not this language. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Mm -hmm. I check more. Mm. Sophia doesn't want to shout when she talks. <laughs> From Cherry Bell. Shout out. You look at Rian, Tina, Ruben. And Glenn from Cabanatuan City. So and then she has a question. After retirement, calling you Miss Hannah, where do you want to stay? Is it in Manchester? Or because we because I know you cancelled your mortgage. So do you wanna stay in Czech Republic or in Philippines if you want to retire? I would like to stay in Philippines, but with the good access to Czech Republic. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. Do you want to eat more rice, Nkai? No. I'm so, so full. Hmm. So, um, maybe I you can stay in Czech Republic for a couple of years? I have I have Philippines. That's like just that. only plan. That's only plan. Know. Yeah. We don't know. From Irene Frias, ask like if when when will you transfer in your new home? No, not anymore. We cancelled the mortgage because of the COVID. Because um, like me now, I don't know when I'm going to go back to work. So there's no assurance yet. So it's really it's like dangerous yeah. when you take mortgage and there's no assurance about your job. When I'm going back to, uh, are, so I cancel it. Mm. At the moment, you know what? To be honest, ah, uh, the government is giving us support. So, but this next month, the government will stop all the support. So it's like the um, yung yung it's a uh, well that has run out of water already. That's what the government said. So they will stop all the support. So I don't know next month where. I'm gonna get the money if I'm not able to go back to work. So from Maria Traya, I don't know what Maria Traya. How do you relate it to uh, my brother-in-law? <laughs> my brother-in-law is Traya as well. What does Hannah feel as when you are having a bonding together? What do you feel when you when we're having bonding together? It's so nice. 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 Last time nice, yeah. on my birthday, I like to go out and uh, enjoy the time outside. But Jeff yeah. loves to stay at home. One one mm -hmm. time, one time when we were spending together in Czech Republic. Yeah, maybe that was two years ago. Mm -hmm. Two years ago when I was five. Mm -hmm. It was the it was the worst day in Czech Republic. It was the worst time in Czech Republic. Yeah. Not really because because I I keep getting mosquito bites and I my fingers were hurting. They were like had mm -hmm. something there and my pinky had a my pinky finger had a bubble here. Mm -hmm. And then I had to be careful mm -hmm. and everything. From J L G Art from J L G Art Pinkai. What kind of Filipino food that you don't like? Uh, I don't know. I have. I, I almost liked almost all the Filipino food. Then? Mm, I don't know. You don't know? Maybe when I'm much older, when I try other Filipino food, maybe I'll tell one day. Oh, how about you? What Filipino food that you don't like? I would definitely. For one hundred percent sure, I would not eat balut. Balut. Oh, okay. For me, I like all food. Even Czech Republic Czech food, I like all. So I don't have problem with that. 
So do we have plan to uh, have another baby? So Sophia will have a brother or sister yeah, from Liza Kosoy. We are. No, we don't have. We we no, don't know. We, we we just leave it open. Yeah. Um? We just leave it open. We don't have a plans. You don't have plans? No. No plans. No plans. No plans. We don't have uh, anyone to uh, look after the baby because we're both working. No, but I yeah. can't. But Sophia wants so much sister or brother. Yeah. So we will see. Please. We'll see. Oh, please. Oh, poor. 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 Okay. Please. <laughs> okay. Um. Hello, Koya. Asked just question. Uh, my boyfriend told me that all women in Czech Republic has all VA at the end of their last name. Yeah. Yes, that's oh, correct. There is just some, uh, mm. I would say, exception. So, Hana, exemption. Hana last name has OVA at the end. OVA, yeah. So, if, what, how do you call that? Evgeny. Evgeny. They're on Olomoc. Oh, this is Regine Limpello. But, uh, yeah, her boyfriend is from Olomoc. Okay. What do we miss in in uh, Philippines? I was five there when I was. What I miss in Philippines? Yeah. I was four there in Philippines. I don't. I don't know. <laughs> I was four. I was four. Uh, well, Philippines. Uh, Philippines been holiday for me, so rest. <laughs> I I been to Philippines when I was four. Mm. Not five. For me, four. Oh. Mm -hmm. And the best family. Yeah. Can yeah. I tell you what? Family. What, that's what, true. Can I tell you the best part in the Philippines? The sweets that he brought. <laughs> yeah, mm. so and beach in Philippines. I would like I love beach. Um shout out to Reina and Mommy Elsie from Reina Mendoza. Uh, oh this is very exciting. Hannah will answer this. Is it true that White people or European people don't take shower in the morning. They only wash their face. They don't take yeah. Is it true? I think yeah. In general, yes. Gen in general, generally speaking, yes. But there are some people who loves to take shower morning, and there are people who loves to take shower evening and even morning. Yeah, but mostly the people actually go clean uh, to the bed. Yeah, but the most important for them is to take shower in the evening because for them, you are from outside, so you are dirty coming home, you have to take shower. Yeah, so when you I take shower in the evening, you are clean, so when you wake up in the morning, all you need to do is brush your teeth, wash your face, make up for the women, and go. Then again, when you come back home, you are dirty, take shower, because this is what I noticed with Hana. She doesn't go to bed without shower because it's dirty, you know, when you sweat outside. Yeah, but also, Hannah no, uh, learns how to take shower yeah, mommy in the knows morning. How to sew. Yeah, mommy to knows make me fresh. <laughs> yes. I think that's the conclusion. There's a main question. I will answer all these questions next time. Okay, because uh, the video is too long. And once again, um... Yeah, I got the highest score. This is the highest score you gave me. 9.5 from Hannah. And Sophia, it's 9. So, do you like the Guinnessang Mungo? Mm. So, that's all for today. And uh, promise I will answer the rest of the question next time. <laughs> Bye! Bye!